you have had a great career, okay? You have been doing some things fantastic, okay? And you are mentoring people, you are giving back to, to, the, to, the, to your society. So I know there's a goal that you mm -hmm. want and I want Africa to achieve in the near future, okay? So mm -hmm. what's your, your vision of Africa in 20, 30 years time? In 30 years time, when I'm yes. officially an old lady, <laughs> um, I, I would like to see an Africa that does not define herself against other people mm. and that does not look outwards for validation or okay. instruction or guidance. Um, I would like to see an Africa where we understand that we, right, are the key, right, mm. to the thing that we're looking for, right, that we are our own solution, um, that other people should not tell us how to be, how to live, um, that we become the global standard for excellence, right? Okay. When people say, you know, global standard, they mean white. That's okay. what they say global standard. Um, an Africa where we understand the power and the influence that we have and we use it for our own benefit and that we are the ones that primarily benefit yes. economically, socially, politically from what we produce, right? Yeah. What comes out of the ground, the people, you know, I think one of, you know, our, our greatest export in Africa is people, yeah. right? Actual intellectual property. I feel like we should be benefiting from that. Um, I look to an Africa where we have leadership, and I, I don't just mean political leadership, I mean leadership at all levels, yep. that has a long-term view, right? Um, that sees, right, that you, you count progress in, in decades. And so they're thinking, what is a 10-year, 20-year plan? I wanna see an Africa where we stop talking and start doing more. Yep. Um, where we collaborate more, where we understand that, you know, and even with the UWK, like it's in the numbers, right? All of us together are a force. And then we take that power that we have and we turn it to create something for ourselves. And the things that we create, we use them to benefit ourselves. Mm. Um, I, want, I want in 30 years for this continent to be where everyone in the world looks to for guidance, for inspiration, right? That's, we that's, should be the standard. Okay, that's great. That is great. Now, let me ask you one additional question. Mm -hmm. How, what, and how, what do we need to do to achieve all this? I think that we all need to take individual responsibility. Okay, right? I agree. It is not somebody else's problem. It is our problem. Okay. Right? So... Yes, many, many, many things are wrong, right? I want all of us, each of us to start thinking, what can I do to begin to work toward the solution? I'm not president. I don't have lots and lots of money, but I can teach, right? I can make sure that I, in my business, we, it, it's, things are done based on merit. Yeah. Right. I can make sure that in my business, we respect people, that we take care of our employees. I don't need, right, to become president to better the life of three, four, five hundred people. Yeah. Right. Over the course of the last, you know, 15 years, what, 15 years in Nigeria, like hundreds of people have come through. Either I've taught them, they've worked for me, I've helped them. Like I have made an appreciable impact in their lives. That's yeah. what we can do. You know, we complain about corruption, but we won't stand in line, right? Mm -hmm. The government the government is not the person that's telling you to throw trash in the street, right? Yeah. We, each of us, need to take personal responsibility. Um, and if there's something that you're complaining about, don't just articulate the problem. Be the solution that you're looking for. Like that, good. I think, is how we shift. Very good. Thank you very yeah. much, Nina. You have thank been you, Akana. Thank you for having guest. me. Thank you. Thank you. Thank, thank you, you so you much. much. All right. Take care. All right. Bye. Take care. Bye. Yeah. yeah. Bye bye. Ooh.